welcome back to my channel it is Brittany so I am at my sister's house we are redecorating her living room and today as I'm filming this it is February what is it it's March 4th I believe and we're getting her downstairs painted the same guy that did my office he's doing her living room so they're taking a lunch break and we're gonna get some food too so I'm gonna flip it around and show you guys what's happening so far. Here's my sister here, Ashley, my sister. So we got agreeable gray on the walls. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I think he said this is just like the first coat they're gonna put on. Oh, okay, yeah. So I used, um, we used Modsy to like come up with the layout cause we're keeping her sectional and stuff the same. Um, and we're just going to be decorating over the next, like, two weekends or so. It shouldn't be that hard. Good morning. It is March 6th, and I'm getting ready to go shopping with my sister and my mama. So, I just did my skincare. Ugh. Let me fix my nose ring. Yeah, I just did my skincare. And I feel like my skin is looking good. Like, um, Miss Christy, if you're watching, we want to see, well, specifically me. I can't speak for everybody else. I want to see a skincare favorites from you because a lot of the recommendations she um, suggested, I like them. So I want to see a skincare favorites video from her. I'm trying to look for my wig cap. I am going to be wearing Elf Woman. I'm going to try to put a little bit of makeup on. No lashes or anything, but just a little bit. I'm going to keep my wig cap on because I washed and conditioned my hair yesterday and I want to keep moisture in my hair. Trying to be really good with taking care of my hair lately. Okay. Let's get these edges laid down. I'm gonna use my She is Bomb Edge Control. All the stuff I'm using will be in my Amazon storefront. My water bottle downstairs, but that's okay. Yeah, I haven't worn um half wigs in a while, but yeah, headband wigs are still amazing. I know that trend has died down significantly as soon as 2021 hit. It like took a nosedive, but they're so convenient and beginner friendly and everything. And um, the lady that's uh, the hairstylist that's helping me with my taking care of my hair, she recommended to wear headband wigs and glueless wigs to um, take care of your hair. Which is good because they're both easy. I need me a good glueless human hair wig just to plop on. I'm sure you could do that really well with um, like closure wigs. So I'm wearing the half wig alpha woman and I'm gonna put my wig grip on not putting that comb in the front because that hurts. We'll see how we can get this going. Alpha Woman has a gorgeous texture and it's not like too long. Y'all know I'm tall, so this might be, you know, considered long for somebody that's shorter. I'm gonna wear me a headband. So I used to have a lot of headbands during 2020, but I think I gave so many away that I don't really have any anymore so let me push this back so i can show more of my edges this was like one of the only ones i had i have to buy some more i still have some on my amazon storefront i might have to purchase some for my own storefront i still have one from um faith's company she used to have in 2020 that was cute it's like a burnt orange one and i have a blue one light blue one too Oh, that's cute. I'm just, I'm just do that. But all right, let's do a little bit of makeup, no lashes. Okay, so I just picked this up when I did my February vlog when I went to Walmart. So I'm gonna use it. It's a dupe for the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. So this one, I forgot how much it is. It's probably like nine dollars. This one's like thirty eight. <laughs> 
So I'm going to use this today and see how it is. Definitely has the same um, consistency. I really appreciate y'all watching my February vlog. Like when I put my vlogs up, I'm just putting them up because I think, because I like doing vlogs and everything, but it's just like this one was different. A lot of people were engaged in watching it. I, my subscribers that watch all of my content tend to watch my vlogs, but not really like people that, you know, are only here for wig reviews. But I felt like people that watch my wig reviews mainly, they watched my February vlog. And I was just like, interesting. So I appreciate that. Ah, yes. Now, one of my followers on Instagram told me to get the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. And I like it. So I put my primer on my face and then on my cheeks, I put this primer because it like mattifies and kind of, it does mattify these areas, but it also um, kind of erases my pores. Like you see how shiny that is? Once I put this on, it gets matte. You see how that does? That's pretty amazing. First is that side, which is shiny. It mattifies it and erases the pores. And you know, this has been around for years, but I've never really used it. But I pair it, ooh. I pair it with um, my Milk Hydro Grip. I put the Milk Hydro Grip down first and then I put this down. And before I did my um, primer, I did put on my Shiseido sunscreen. Yeah. Okay. Let's color correct a little bit. If you're new to makeup, when you color correct, you're kind of canceling out your darkness before you put on any foundation. So your dark spots, your dark spots don't peek through. Okay, so I just, I told you guys in my February vlog that I was, I'm on a wellness journey. So I have this nutritionist I found on TikTok. She's black. Um, I just, I just wanted a black nutritionist because a black woman nutritionist because I just feel like she would understand me more. Um, and she's certified, like, had to make sure she was, um, like a certified dietitian or she was a certified nutritionist. So I had to do a um, food diary for a week. Wet and wild, toffee, photo focus. I had to do a food diary for a week and um, I've got to, I got to send it over so she can do an analysis on it and tell me what I should stop doing and you know, anything I'm doing well right now. So, um, so I've been on this wellness journey with my hair, my weight, and just spiritually for probably the last uh, month. And I haven't gained any weight. I've lost a few pounds, like literally like two or three pounds, but it's nice to see the scale not go up. And I've been sticking to my every, every other day doing a workout, even if it's like a 10 minute hit workout, which is high intensity interval training so I like the HIIT workouts because I don't like working out for more than well right now since I'm you know easing back into it I don't like working out for a long time I just can't so 10 minutes of intense workout is enough for me and it doesn't overwhelm me because 10 minutes is nothing you know that's you can do 10 minutes. Well, I can dedicate myself to 10 minutes instead of like 30, 45 with, you know, at home workouts and stuff. And then yesterday I did um, a gym tour at a gym that's close to me. And I'll be starting with a personal trainer tomorrow morning. And I'm just going to do it for 30 minutes because I got stuff to do. And I can't be up in there all day. I got stuff to do. But I'm still wanna still wanna take care of myself. So I think I want to start off with two days a week with strength training and then do cardio at home. 
um yeah but we'll see how this goes i'm pretty excited about it and proud of myself for just doing it you know not making excuses but just doing it I'm going to finish up my makeup and then I'll see you guys like when I get to my mama's. Hey y'all. So good morning. It is March. I think it's March 7th like it's a Monday and it is almost 9 a.m. and this is my first day meeting my um personal trainer so I did get a personal trainer and I'm going to be working on strength training I have never been somebody who lifts weights but I I've been watching a lot of Alyssa Ashley's videos and other women who advocate for lifting and I'm excited to see how it goes oh somebody's calling me somebody just called me so when i'm working out i don't i don't care how i look y'all but i don't really care how i look because i'm not trying to impress nobody up in here also i don't wear wigs when i work out even when i'm at home when i'm at home i don't even wear a wig cap i just wear my my sealy braids and that's what i do but um the reason why i do that is because when I was taking this walking class when I was in college and I would work out and I would wear those half wigs and those half wigs have comb in, combs in them. And when you're working out hard and you're sweating in your head, a bacteria grows on those combs. So of course you can wear your wig and then take it off and clean your comb, sanitize it. But I don't even want to risk that at all. So I'm just wearing a head wrap and then when I get home, um, I can either wash my hair or just take like some sea breeze and clean my scalp, you know. Um, you can, you know, shower and wash your hair or take some sea breeze and clean your scalp of all that sweat. Um, but I just prefer not to wear a wig when I'm working out because I don't feel like, um, you know, risking that. So that is what I'm going to do. And then I have to film some content because March is very busy with content. Um, at, uh, to yesterday I put up my Amazon spring dress video. It went very well. It actually is performing really well, like on par with my week reviews, which is surprising. So that means I'm probably going to do more, um, clothing content. Cause it seems like there's a, a demand for it. And I appreciate that. Good morning guys. It is March. 8th, which is International Women's Day, so, you know. And um, today I will be, um, at 10 o'clock, me and Adrian, we have therapy. And then after that, I'll be editing some videos. And I think that's about it. I, I'll have a premiere for the video because it's going to be my Walmart and Target Spring Summer Sandals Haul. Um, you know, by now you guys will have already seen that video and you guys can watch that if you haven't already. Um, Coda is just here chilling. Coda. Hey baby. We gave him a bath this morning. Um, yeah, so that's what I have going on today. Uh, I think I have the footage of me in the car when I was having my first consultation with my personal trainer. So he's very nice. I like him. And it doesn't seem like he's going to be, like, crazy pushy. Hey, booty. What's up? That's you. What's your cute self? You got a good bath. Now you're going for your morning nap. <laughs> he just did that sigh. He does that sigh when I'm talking too much, getting on his nerves. Does your dog do that or your pet in general? <laughs> so I'm about to start editing, and I'll talk to you guys later. Hey, guys. Today is March... 16th and oh you might get a copyright with that music so i just had a shoot with ariel we haven't shot together since christmas and um i was originally going to do some outfits for a collab i have with um is that your hair but we're going to push it back to april like 
like around April 7th. So you guys look out for that video because I already bought some of my clothes and I'm getting the outfits together. Um, and then I have another collab in April and I'm excited about it. I'm enjoying the fashion hauls. So um, yeah, I just did a couple of like four outfits. It's very dark and rainy today. So I wanted to give spring in my in my um, pictures, but it's so dark and moody kind of in the pictures, but it's still a vibe. So today I'm wearing, um, what company is this? Janet Collections Jenna. This was my favorite wig, one of my favorite wigs in 2019 and I haven't worn it in so long. Um, I was gonna do, so my shoot was at 12 and I was gonna record this RPG show review before and just wear it in the the in the shoot but my hot comb stopped working and the hot comb is one of the most important things in laying your wig and making it look nice and flat and sleek and natural so um right now the person from target just pulled up to deliver my new hot comb actually <laughs> yeah it's that serious like I can't live without my hot comb. So the one I've had from Andis, I've had it for years and it just went out today when I needed it. So it worked out though, cause the Jenna was easy to, you know, put on and everything. So just got my hot comb. Um, Adrian's going to get it from, from the guy. And then um, I'm just going to take a little break before I start filming yeah this this day has been kind of all over the place but it still worked out it still worked out so that's where we are and this morning i went to um the gym that i go to they're having a competition where um it starts today which is march 16th and it goes through june 8th and it's like a weight loss competition whoever loses the most i think body fat wins a thousand dollars and I was like I'm already on a uh you know wellness journey weight loss journey so I might as well try and we'll see where we are in June so that is what we got going on today hey y'all so today is March 23rd I'm about to get ready to record a wig review by the by the time this video goes up of course everything is already up so this I'm going to be recording Outre Bexley today. It's a new wig. It kind of looks like Katia. So we'll see how that is. Um, and it's a collab with Wheezy. So me, Wheezy, and still looking good. We talk literally every every day. So um Faith told us about Bexley. Well, I think Wheezy told us about Bexley. I don't know. And we both got our wigs at the same time, so we're gonna do a collab today that's what i have going on i did an at-home workout today my uh physical my uh, personal trainer he sent me a workout and i did that if you um are on like a weight loss wellness journey how long did it take for you to start seeing results like with um weightlifting exercising consistently because i'm right now i'm at three days a week of you know working out um and I mainly do weight training because I just hear that's better than solely doing cardio when did you start seeing results because I've been doing this for about uh three weeks three or four weeks now I just want to know how long it takes so that's what I have going on I'm about to record from our TikTok and everything. Last video, I told y'all I had 3,000 on TikTok for being consistent from just late December to early, late December to end of February. And then now I went viral last weekend with uh, Adana, which is an old wig, which is crazy. Um, and now I'm at 8,000 followers on TikTok. It's so crazy how you can grow on there so quickly. Again, what is Instagram doing? Like I had, a, I've had an Instagram since 2012 and I'm 
stuck at 49,000 followers, which is good, but it's taken, I can probably get to 50K on TikTok in a couple of months, maybe in like six months to like a year or something, but Instagram, it's like they don't want creators to grow on there. It's horrible. TikTok is just showing them up and it's just insane. Like I, like all of my YouTube friends are starting to go viral on TikTok. It's no incentive to really post on Instagram. I mean, they are paying creators a little bit, but it's not like everywhere. Um, Kai, she went viral on TikTok and so did Is That Your Hair recently? And we're, we're pretty new to the TikTok platform and we're going viral just doing stuff we do all the time on Instagram. It's so crazy. So if you are somebody who's new to creating content, definitely start a TikTok. Cause it's like they act, you actually get to see new people and you have a new audience. Like I've been around for nine years with creating content and on TikTok, I feel like there's new people that actually see me every day. And it's just cool, man. It's just cool. It's giving people who don't usually have a voice on Instagram, they have a voice now and it's just so cool. So I I know Instagram has to be scrambling right now because they're just not doing what's best for content creators. I don't feel like it. Good morning, y'all. It is March 27th and I am about to go to brunch with my mama and my sister. We haven't um, gone out to eat in a long time. It's been like two years. So we're gonna do that today and I'm excited. I'm wearing that Her Given Hair wig again. I wear this all the time. I like stretched it last night. I did like five or six big twists and it stretched out and I think it looks pretty. And I have on that denim dress from Fashion Nova in that video I did um, a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, that's what I have going on this Sunday. Excited to be out. Um, yesterday I had to do one of my cousins make up for her 13th birthday and it turned out really cute. I was like nervous to do it because I've never done preteen, a preteen's makeup or a teenager's makeup. And it looked good. It was age appropriate and she looked really pretty. So I actually have on the lashes today that I used on her because they look so good on her. Uh, these are Ardell lashes. I don't even know what number, but they're just like super natural. I like to wear like more natural looks with when I wear like natural wigs like this because I feel like it complements it. And this headband came with, I think it came with this wig, like her giving hair sent it over. And then I have on these cute bracelets from Walmart. And my hand is almost healed. Like I don't have to wear the glove if I don't want to. Um, it's almost healed. I think in a couple of days, it'll be all the way healed. So that's what we got going on. Adrian's going to put some air in my tires and then I'll be on my road to my sister's house. We've been decorating her house all month and it's almost done and it looks really good. My sister, my weenie, it's my mama. I'm gonna get this here. A traditional. And Ashley, which one are you gonna get? The shrimp grits. <laughs> you wanna show your nails off? <laughs> guys well it's afternoon actually it's march 29th thursday and i just feel really good today i freaking i love spring so much it just like energizes me so today so far i have done an at-home workout um on monday i didn't go to the gym with my personal trainer honestly the sunday before that was the will smith chris rock thing by now that's like way over thank god 
and I was up late a lot later than I usually am so I didn't I was too tired to go to the gym and Coda stayed home from camp too so yeah so I did an at-home workout today um I didn't do it yesterday because I had to film this review actually this is an OMG her hair relax yakky wig even though I gotta put this in my March favorites video this wig is amazing 100% glueless. This is plopped on my head. And baby is giving. It looks really, really good. Um, and I have no makeup on or anything. And it just, just looks really natural. 16 inches. If you haven't watched that review yet, you should go watch it. Okay? This is worth buying right here. Any wig I wear like on an everyday basis outside of filming and I just keep reaching for it, you should buy it. This is one of them. Um, so yeah, I, uh, just to update on my wellness journey, um, specifically like my weight loss journey, I'm seeing some non-scale wins. Like I haven't had any issues with my stomach or constipation or anything. And that's a big deal. Cause I've had issues with that since I was little. And then I had on this two piece set that I got from Amazon back in January and it fit very different in February in February when I wore it. Then I wore it last night and it looks very different. Like my stomach isn't, you don't see my stomach as much in it. So um, I'm seeing some non-scale wins. I haven't lost that much weight, but it just feels like I have though, cause I just feel better. Um, so I'm doing this competition with my gym since I'm already working out. I don't know if I told you guys this. So it started March 16th and it'll go through June 8th. And the person who le uh, loses the most like body fat percentage or whatever can win a thousand dollars. And I was like, I'm already on the journey. So I'm going to try and see if I can win. So I've been consistent for a month. So we got two more months to go. And I'm so glad I started when I did. Um, yeah, I just feel good about everything. So we're about to go get Coda some um, food and come back home and I'm chilling for the rest of the day. I need to get my toes done, okay? Especially before I start doing these clothing hauls because I have two uh, collabs coming up in April with, you know, two people I've already collaborated with, but I like to collaborate with the same people that <laughs> I really do. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I have two Amazon clothing collabs coming up in April and I'm excited about it. So I'm gonna show y'all Coda real quick because some of y'all be wanting to see him. Yeah. Hey, baby. You ready to go for a ride? You excited? You ready to go for a ride? <laughs> he be so excited. Oh, God. Ah! Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, sit down. Sit down, crazy. He hopped all on my head, y'all. Crazy self. Hey, y'all. So, I recorded my... um ninth anniversary youtube anniversary video and i have on outre brianne <laughs> so i had to record that video like three times it's it's very long but uh is that coming up before this it should be up before this so watch it if you haven't i hope you guys enjoyed the um uh, march vlog this month i kind of got out the house just a little bit so I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.